this is what we're going to be using for charging the go-kart. This should be able to charge those batteries at about 5.6 kilowatts. At least that's the power rating of the panels altogether. And <clears throat> they're wired right now to about 150 volts output. And and then I I made a little maximum power point charger inside the shop back there that the components at least could charge at about a 200 amp rate but so that's not really the weak link it's really the solar panels that can't put out that much power and so up until now I've just been charging um, 48 volt battery bank but I'm just going to make it so you can just charge the the regular battery pack instead just a little software change so let's go see the maximum power point tracker this is actually a pretty simple thing to build it's just an IGBT half bridge from eBay and a 200 amp inductor back there and a output capacitor. So it's basically just a, a what they call a buck converter. It just has a, a high voltage input and a lower voltage output. So right now it was charging these lead acid batteries for the last four years pretty much this thing has been running just about 24 hours a day I mean it doesn't do much charging at night but it's still running <laughs> trying to charge at night also <coughs> and I haven't had any problems with it it's been very reliable so now all I'm gonna do is run some wires from the output of the buck converter the maximum power point tracker that is so run it from there right out here and then just charge the go-kart at about 5.6 kilowatts and you don't have to change it to AC first it makes it a lot more efficient just going straight from DC stepping it down a little bit to another DC voltage so I'll be charging it at about 93 volts output so it should be a very efficient so I'll actually do it in a couple of days but this was just a little kind of a prelude sort of thing <coughs> 